Quigley to kick it off for the Eagles, and we're underway here in South Florida. From the end zone, Dorset. Tripped up shy of the 20. Way too many turnovers, too many interceptions. Corrected that problem, has really had a stellar season. 19 touchdown passes, just five interceptions thrown this year for Harris. Lamar Miller, the talented running back sophomore in, but Harris goes to the air, wide open, and a big play on the first play. Benjamin at the 30 and keeping the play alive. But we talked about right at the open, Jacor Harris, bottom of your screen, watch the straight go route by Travis Benjamin. He's been a source of big plays throughout his career and once again just runs right by the defense. It's like they were standing still. 681st completion thrown by Harris in his career. That one good for 60 yards on the opening play from scrimmage. First and 10 from the 20. Low snap. Another completion. Streeter with the grab. Al Golden looking on. Harris under center. Miller behind him, first rush of the game. And that'll be enough for a first down to you. Miller stays in as Harris goes to the shotgun. All the receivers to the left. Harris will run it. And slides just shy of the five. The opening play. Second and goal from the seven. And in motion is Bird. Empty backfield. Bird gets it to the five. Bird. This play was a spectacular effort by Laron Bird. Laron Bird, but watch the outside, the blockers getting a couple cut blocks for him, and then just the singular effort by Bird to punch it in the end zone on his own. Senior to senior on senior day. 7-0 Canes. Seven for seven last week on the game-winning drive. A perfect three for three on that one. Harris also with one rush for three yards. Miami will now kick it off. Jake Whitelaw sending it high, not very deep. Fielded inside the 15. Smithy Evans, two freshman, takes a hit at the 30. He's the preseason ACC Player of the Year. Reddick under center will go to the air on their first play. Finds the tight end, Lars Anderson, a pickup of five on first down. That'll bring up second and five. There is Spence, the senior from Miami. Shotgun, quick strike, complete. First down, Swiger. Swiger, hard down. Possession type hands. First rush of the day from DC. It's Taj Kimball, the redshirt freshman from Florida in the future. Hasn't had a lot of developmental time. It's been more preparation time for him. Another rush, Kimball breaks the tackle, first down, gain of five. He's going to have to focus on the football and not listen to Chase Reddick's voice. Two Miami penalties for 10 yards on this drive. Kimball. Not only... Across the middle, ball dropped, and then recovered. They're going to call it a completion. Dante Elliott with the grab. Up at the top of your screen, you're just going to see a little under route, five yards up and then across the field. That is a bang-bang play right there for Dante Elliott. Kimball. Is maybe a yard. Sean Spence penetrating drive from the linebacker really position. Is that, but Sean Spence has been pretty special for the Miami defense. He's played all over this past few weeks playing the Mike linebacker position and one thing he does really well is get tackles for a loss and those are the types of game-changing plays that defensive coordinators love. Had 14 TFLs coming in to today's finale. Second and ten. Formation for BC. 
Quick strike, good hands, first down. Home winning streak in the nation, the Honey Badger. Oh. All over it, which I believe was your Halloween costume. That well. was. Ninth play coming up for the Eagles. Kimball the carry. Kimball searching towards the five. Just hasn't been able to put it all together for an entire season. High formation again for BC on second and goal. Denzel Perryman in the backfield. A loss of four. How about true freshman Denzel Perryman? He's going to shoot the gap right there. All of a sudden shows up in your screen. Big tackle from the nine. Redick, touchdown, wide open in the middle of the end zone, Pantelli. Nate Freeze on to try and complete this drive and tie things up. Chase Redick, his 17th career touchdown. Chase Redick, five for five, 52 yards and a touchdown on that drive for the Eagles. Low kick will bounce. Hot one handled by Benjamin. Benjamin runs out of bounds right after live on WatchESPN.com. Kind of a busy day tomorrow in college football. A lot of implications will end around Miller and Miller net and Miller loses ground. Keekly with the tackle. Much faster than him, Lamar Miller. Loss of seven on the play brings up second and 17 as we approach five minutes left in the first. Harris, batted down, flag comes down. Streeter, the intended target, Donnie Fletcher is he's had. The big decision he has to make whether to go to the NFL or not. Miller. Miller breaking free. Miller may go the distance. 20, 10, Miller, touchdown, Miami. 79 yards. The guy who just had that huge touchdown is going to have a decision to make on his own. Todd McShay says he's the 14th best product prospect and the number two running back behind Alabama's twin. Richardson. Oh, and you see why the breakaway speed. Let's look at what made this play successful though. A lot of the blocking up front. Watch the tackle here. Pull and lead the way for Lamar. Actually the guard, excuse me, number 66, Harlan Gunn. All you do is leave a little crease for Lamar Miller and the rest is history. I mean this is a guy with track speed out there running on the edge. You almost have no chance to catch him once he gets to the open field. The longest run of his career and the longest play from scrimmage for Miami this year with that run. Miller passes Clinton Portis and goes into fourth in the single season yard list here at the University of Miami. Evans and Albert Lewis Jean back deep for the Eagles. White loss kick. Tall and again short. Andre Williams, the sophomore tailback behind him. Anderson in motion, they give it to Williams. And Williams with the hole and a first down. All the injuries, Boston College, if you look at their schedule, they appear to have gotten better as the season has progressed. Another carry for Williams. This one not as productive, but still a healthy gain of where their tradition has been based. They've produced a lot of great talent from the offensive line. Another carry here for Williams. Close to midfield. Kevin Rogers, he lost. Dave Brock had to step in on short notice. Reddick, first down. Swiger. Numbers. Williams, another carry, across the 30 before he's tripped up. Down at the 28, gain of four. That weakness. Quarterbacks today combined nine for nine and two touchdowns. Power 
powerful run here by Williams. Williams has carried on five of the six plays this drive. This is the seventh coming up. They've already traveled 57 yards in over three minutes. Met and stuck and dropped. Williams colliding with Porter significantly this season. Eighth play coming up. Very little there. Denzel Perryman, another hit. Williams now seven carries on this drive alone. Show that one. All right, right here is a big third down for Chase Reddick. Needs to be smart with the football. Make sure you don't take a sack. Try to get some extra yards for your kicker. Third and 12 from the 16. Reddick under pressure. Keeps the play alive. Thinking about running it, and he will. Out of bounds just inside the 15. Just Denzel Perryman. Nine this campaign. This from 30. And it's a four-point game. They lost him. They lost a huge chunk of offense, offensive production. Harris did come back from that knee injury and then was shelved again. They're hoping he might be able to get a medical hardship and be back next season. Benjamin from his end zone. And stuffed at the 20. Achieving that. Don't sleep on Arkansas, though. They can put up some points. Four possessions, four scores for these two teams combined already. Harris slinging on a dangerous one intended for Streeter. Flying all over the field and expect to see a whole lot more of that today. Miller's 79-yard touchdown run in the first quarter. Longest run by a Hurricane since 2000. Second and 10 from the 20. Miller. We'll give him a yard. That'll bring up for Miami. Snuck out with a win. Third and long for the Kings. Harris from the shotgun drops back. Takes the simple completion and will be short, just barely, of a first down. I think that situation is one of the box. The redshirt sophomore from Taft, California, will kick it to Bobby Swigert. Swigert standing at his 29. Roams forward, calls for a fair catch, and pulls it in at the 34. <laughs> Around a slew. Touchdown and a field goal on their first two drives. Redick the handoff to Kimball. Maybe two passes on the season coming in. He has been perfect thus far. Second and eight for the Eagles. A quick strike. Another up in and out of the hands of the true freshman Spiffy Evans. Rob Stone, Danny Cannell back here with you, and we'll have the quarterback in this game. No turnovers thus far. Reddick fires, complete first down. And Chase Reddick continues to get solid pass protection. Landon Fitch, the third Eagle tailback to get a carry already. The dual threat quarterback. There's a lot of folks in Boston who just want to see him throw to see if he may be able to compete with Reddick. Next season, another carry, another big run, another first down for BC, and it's Finch, the sophomore from New Albany, Indiana. 69, he's having a big day so far. Sixth play of the drive coming up, first and 10. Finch again across the 30. Just shy of the 20, and another first down. Perryman with BC, time of possession. 1452 for BC, under five minutes for Miami, but it's the Canes with the lead. First and ten, another up, and another healthy game. Pushed around up front. 19 rushes already of BC's 27 plays today. Finch has to claw to get back to the college. BC two of four on third down today. Shotgun formation for Reddick. Reddick will run it. Reddick will be short. Ch Chase Reddick keeps it himself, tries to get to the first down marker. When he does, see the ball at the end of the play, gets stripped out by number 56, Marcus Robinson. Pretty impressive job by Marcus Robinson. 
knowing that Chase Reddick is going for that extra yardage, that ball comes loose and just strips it loose. And here's Boss that first down. He's only thrown it twice this season. Bordner, side. Miami takes over. Perryman, the true freshman with the initial contact. He may be the next great linebacker here at Miami, and Al Golden's D stifles BC. 18 to 10. They got pushed around until it mattered on that fourth down. Big defensive stop. Lamar Miller, the tailback, he's rushed for 76 yards on four touches, so get a few more here on first down. We'll give him two, maybe three. He played with a lot of folks. <laughs> that is true. In the, in the Arena League or the NFL? Play action, complete. Dragged down by Keekley, right at about the 20. John Calhoun is the Canes. Miami, though, averaging just over 14 yards per play, somewhat skewed by that 79-yard run by Miller. Here's another big play they're looking for, and almost intercepted. It's open, so Ja'Cory Harris knew he had a mismatch. You have a wide receiver against a middle linebacker. The problem you run into is that middle linebacker is Luke Keekley, one of the best in the country. Great field presence, awareness by Keekley to look up. I mean, Tommy Streeter is six. Second three now by the Canes. Swiger, another fair catch at the 38. Andre Williams, and another carry by BC. 17 of their last 20 plays have now been rushes. Sean Spence. Might see him move around a little bit in the NFL. He's had the best year of anyone on the Miami D, according to their staff. Second and eight. Play action, Reddit going right, complete. First down, grab by Elliott. Think about all the great talent Miami has sent to the NFL. Pittsburgh is next, and they're number 12. Andre Williams, the game. Down the field it. early, which I think they've set up nicely. Second and nine, BC has moved the ball. They've yet to punt today. Reddit. Going big, not even close to his intended receiver. Looking for Colin Larmon, and we send it to John. Need to get to the 37. Reddick trying to buy some time, and Reddick will go down. First time Ryan Quigley on to punt. Two players back from Miami to return, both at the 10, Dorsett and Benjamin. Lofted towards Benjamin. Calls for a fair catch. will go out of bounds. And it'll be finally marked out at in the opening quarter. Corey Harris, empty backfield from the shotgun. Gain of four on the completion here. They might have to do that. Second and six. To the ground. Miller. Showing that track speed down shy of the 40. Or not. You have guys like Lamar Miller was corralled at the beginning of this play. A couple of my BC defenders had some penetration, but Lamar Miller is so elusive. When he gets to that second level, you do not want to be on an island facing him coming at you. That one good for 25 yards. He's now at 104. Harris, a big collision. Threw that one into triple team. And has coverage. seen almost every situation he could throw at him. Double. Benjamin. To the 40. Gain of one. Third and long. Harris. Keeping the play alive. Trying to buy time for a receiver. Now he's going to tuck it and run it. And he'll be shy of a first down. It's going to be a long halftime for them. They're going to need to get a... Nice talking to by Al Golden, which I expect they will get. Box and the punt team letting this clock drip down as low as it can. Nice punch. Swiger, fair catch ball inside his 10. Box's performance, not worthy of a nomination. 
BC will take a knee, and that'll put a close to a very quick-moving first half. Miami went up seven.